In the beginning of time, Zeus, the supreme god of Olympus, consolidated himself as the supreme lord of the universe. But before he had the goddess Hera as his queen, Zeus had had another wife. There was a goddess as beautiful as she was wise. Her name was Metis. She was the daughter of the Titan Ocean, who helped Zeus free his brothers from Cronus' stomach during the Titanomachy. Zeus was fascinated by the precious deity and wanted to take her as his wife, but the goddess resisted the god's approaches. Metis tried to escape from the god in every way, but Zeus was persistent. The goddess had the power of metamorphosis and could transform herself into anything. She used this power to escape Zeus. But Metis could not escape Zeus forever. The god set an ambush for the disguised goddess. The Lord of Thunder jumped on Metis and grabbed her. The goddess could not escape the god's strong arms and submitted to his will. With the cunning goddess at his side, Zeus's reign seemed more prosperous. The god seemed able to tame all the chaos that had reigned in the world since primordial times. However, on a visit to Gaia, the primordial goddess who personifies the earth revealed a terrible omen. Gaia told Zeus that his wife would have two children. The first would be a girl who would equal the strength and wisdom of her father, but the second would be a boy who would become stronger than his father and take away his power. Zeus feared having the same outcome as his father, the titan Cronus, or his grandfather, the god Uranus. Both had been dethroned by their sons. But inspired by his father, Zeus devised a plan to prevent the omen from coming true. Zeus asked Metis to transform herself into a drop of water so she could give him a taste of her metamorphic power. The god swallowed his wife so that she could not give birth to the being that would dethrone Zeus. After swallowing his wife, Zeus incorporated the gifts of the goddess Metis. He became a much wiser, fairer, and less impulsive god. But he didn't know that she was already pregnant. Time passed, and the powerful god began to feel headaches. He felt a horrible pain. His head seemed about to explode. Zeus asked for his head to be opened, and the source of the pain to be removed. He couldn't withstand such pain. The titan Prometheus struck the god on the head with an axe. A strong light began to emerge from the open crack in Zeus's head. A female figure surfaced on Zeus's head. From Zeus's forehead emerged the goddess Athena. With her armor and weapons fully grown, Zeus was proud to give birth to that formidable creature. With her mother's intelligence, Athena would become the goddess of wisdom. She was also considered the goddess of defensive warfare. Therefore, confrontations against Ares, the god of war, would be inevitable. Metis remained in Zeus's stomach, and the prophecy of the couple's second child was never fulfilled. Athena proved to be a brave, pure, just, and wise goddess. She was considered the favorite daughter of Zeus, and was thought by many to be Zeus's legitimate successor.